holding the camera so close to my face sorry to everyone i hope zooming it out a bit makes it less cringy and also hello it's steph and because i was quite incoherent in this vlog because i was shy nervous and also it's been a while since i vlog i thought to narrate bits of the vlog for clarity and it's always been a dream of mine to have someone narrate my story but i guess like most of my dreams i Gotta do it myself, hashtag independent woman. But enough of this monologue and let's go back to the mono vlog. <laughs> Laugh at my jokes, please. Baby, get it. So we arrived at around 12.30 and these many people were already in line. To be honest, I thought I'd have a chance to just look at the planner first because I wanted to feel the paper which I couldn't do if I ordered it online. But the lines were already categorized to who was buying, who was picking their planner up, and who was here for the meet and greet with Winnie. And yeah, no line for just wanna feel the paper and maybe leave without buying. And a bit after one, Winnie arrives and they start letting people in. I think we waited around 10 minutes before we were able to go in. And then we were welcomed with chocolates. I wanted to get a lot but also I was afraid the chocolate would stick to my teeth and the vlog would be completely ruined. This is the purchasing booth and I am holding a planner because as I said earlier, I wanted to feel the paper. But there in the moment, I realized it would be kind of embarrassing and maybe just a bit rude to just leave without buying. So did I unnecessarily pressure myself into buying something I may not have wanted had I not been in that situation? Maybe. But I also bought one for my BFF Jillian so I could've just bought hers and left and it wouldn't be rude cause technically I bought something. But when you're in the moment and you can't think about it too long, you just go for it. I always live by the phrase, better to regret things you've done than things you didn't do. And this was the moment I realized the marketing value of a pop-up store. But don't worry guys, I didn't regret it. Hashtag no regrets. After making your purchase, you go through two photo booth areas before exiting the pop-up and they were both wonderfully made but I just really fell in love with this pink hologram one. And then you have the options to engrave your initials onto your planner. SY for Steph Yeah. This is me trying to call Jillian because I didn't know if she wanted her plan engraved or maybe she wanted to keep the purity of it or something along the lines of that. So hello, we're at the back of the line again. We want to have I find I and Chella being the good friend here is accompanying me. So yeah, we're going to I mean I'm I want to meet and greet Penelope Pop. So yeah, here we are. I just bought planner. So I put my initials, Stephia, because like that's the amount of commitment I have for this planner and Penelope Pop. Because if you like it, you should put a ring on it and in this case like engrave it with your initials. Yes. So while we're waiting in a really long line, let's take this time to have a planner tour. And this is the planner tour, just me flipping through it because I realized that it was getting embarrassing to film while lots of people were just going around you. Also, Winnie has tutorials on her planner on her channel, which are 200% more helpful than what I'll ever come up with. So I'll just make sure to link her videos down below. And oh my god, look at that line. It took us 20 minutes this time. Next.
So because the audio is crappy, hey Steph, buy yourself a vlog mic this Christmas, why don't ya? I'm just gonna narrate what I talked about with Winnie to the best of my lip reading and memory. I remember the first thing I said to her was that the first video I saw of hers was her dance video which was filmed right here in Glorietta. Such a big fan. Oh, this Hi. is Chella. Hi, Chella. This is her <laughs> What's your name? Oh, um, Steph. Wow, Steph, almost five minutes into talking and you didn't even tell her your name. Wow. I have really ugly handwriting, so I might ruin your planner. No, 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 not at all. <laughs> what's your, um, what's your, how do you spell it? PH, yeah. And I also told her how much I love her vlogs with her mom because they speak in Mandarin and it inspires me to improve on my Mandarin. Hashtag Phil Chayan proud. I also hold my pen weirdly. Is it like the Moppet way? <laughs> no, just the weird way. <laughs> Baby, hit it. And this is Winnie signing Jillian's planner. Jillian still hasn't replied to any of my texts or answered any of my calls, but I was thinking she could buy the everyday planner anytime. But to get one signed by Winnie, that would make my present all the more special. So who cares about the purity of things? We are meant to make our mark in this world. Well, that monologue took an unexpected turn. <laughs> Julian, if you're watching this, I really hope you don't, because I can't regift this anymore. So I was supposed to take a picture with Winnie, but then something came up, and the only logical thing to do was to dance for a bit. I guess. I love these pictures so much. Thank you, Chella. You are the best. And is it just me, or do me and Winnie look like we're BFFs here? It's probably, definitely, just me. <laughs> FYI, I'm the super cool friend. So now I'm definitely having Jillian's planner engraved because it already has a dedication to her. So why not go all the way with the personalization, you know? So that is the end of the everyday event. And after that, me and Cello went around Glorietta for some Christmas shopping. And along the way, I pointed out to her some of Winnie's murals. And we even got a moment of serendipity when we saw this Fuji film and sex booth where you could take photos for free if you post about it. And also a raffle, but I just got a pen. And shout out to my buddy Chella for being a champ and accompanying me in the everyday event even though planners weren't her thing. Hashtag true friend. And I guess this is the end of the vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed my narration and I hope to see you guys in the next step by Steph Yao. Bye!